we're hitting all of our teams with strong records, which means <laughs> our Red Hot Braves can only be next. They're back at home this weekend playing host to Gadsden County. Will the Braves stay perfect or can the Jags shake it up? Well, it was two very athletic teams from the show. Look at those backflips from both sides coming out of the gate. Well, now just a few minutes into the first quarter, Braves wasting no time to get the lead. Wells Bettenhausen hands it off to Cornelius Nuke McKenzie. He breaks through the Jags defense and into the end zone, putting the Braves up 6-0 to zero after the extra point goes wide. Well, less than three minutes on the clock in the first Jags ball, Sean Terrace Thomas sends the ball down to Nath Williams. He blasts past Walton's dread, dread in Beambo to put Gadsden on the board, bringing the score 7-6. Jack's ball again. Thomas is going to hand it off to Raquavius Lewis. He spins, he jukes, and when he looks like he's going down, he's up and running until Malcolm Bird and Cameron Blackburn finally take him down. Well, Braves turn just over four minutes left in the half. Bettenhausen sees Anton Morris in the end zone, makes this pack look, pass look so effortless. Braves back in the lead 13 to 7. It's a back and forth battle all the way to the finish. Walton comes from behind to force an overtime. The Braves score first, the Jags respond. Now it goes into second overtime and Walton goes for the two point conversion. It's good. Braves win it 43 to 42 to stay perfect. Wow, incredible win.